What did Mucky Minx Meghan Markle do for Randy Andy as a yacht girl? We once more draw attention to the muddied, murky, and dishonest behavior of this purported yacht girl, as author Kirby Summers speculates that the then Meghan Markle likely spent time with Prince Andrew and Jeffrey Epstein before meeting Prince Harry. Following a tip from a well-known journalist from a major newspaper, the Steeple Times published an article in January 2020 posing the question, did the then Meghan Markle meet Prince Andrew before she met Prince Harry? Or did she first meet a friend of the late child molester Jeffrey Epstein? Now that Tom Bowers' revenge books after effects are still causing Twitter to buzz and her brazen PR peddler Omid Scobie has revealed that he is penning a Finding Freedom sequel, this exact question has come up once more. Author of Ghislaine Maxwell, an unauthorized biography Kirby Summers explores the connections between the Duchess of Sussex, Prince Andrew, Jeffrey Epstein, and Ghislaine Maxwell in a 35-49 minute podcast posted on YouTube late last week. Summers asserts that the mainstream media may have a photo of her on a yacht in Phuket, Thailand, cavorting with Prince Andrew at the direction of the filthy Madame Maxwell and the since-deceased pedophile Epstein. This effectively implies that Markle's mate, Marcus Anderson of Soho House, is a connector going back to 2001. Further, the author offers proof that Markle was given an invitation to the Yacht Week 2016 in Croatia by a person by the name of Adam Houn. It is unknown if the actress attended the hedonistic Tinder at Sea event, which one participant, Sweet Home Alabama dating show bachelor Tribble Reese praised as like the Bahamas on steroids. Tinder was founded by William Venkel in 2006 and was described as Sodom and Gomorrah at Sea by GQ in 2015. The Duchess of Sussex, is controlled by the same forces that control Jeffrey Epstein, Summers concluded on Twitter. Unsurprisingly, requests for comment from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, the Duke of York, and their representatives went unanswered. Matthew Steeples published a poll on Twitter. When Meghan Markle was younger, who did she first meet, and was she a yacht girl? Either Prince Harry or Prince Andrew? It has received 500 votes in less than 24 hours, indicating interest in the topic, with the majority of people believing that the former actress was indeed a yacht girl for Prince Andrew before meeting her current husband. Tweets by crusading author of Ghislaine Maxwell, an unauthorized biography Kirby Summers about the connection between the Duchess of Sussex, the Duke of York and in the late Jeffrey Epstein. Kate and William to extend hand of friendship to Harry at coronation as King too busy. Harry and Meghan have not yet confirmed they will attend the ceremony in May. Kate, Princess of Wales and Prince William will have to extend the hand of friendship if Prince Harry returns to the UK for his father's coronation, according to an expert. It is not yet known if Harry and Meghan Markle will attend, but it is thought King Charles will have too many other concerns to make his youngest son his main priority. Invitations for the coronation are expected to be sent out very soon, with Express. Co. UK confirming that Harry and Meghan will receive one. However, Relations between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal family have been strained since their relocation to the U.S., with their Netflix documentary and Harry's memoir spare further worsening relations. Their potential trip to the U.K. has been planned for by Buckingham Palace, with reports that Harry will be making a brief weekend stopover while Meghan stays at home in California to celebrate their son Archie's fourth birthday on the same day. Royal expert Camilla Tomini has said that it will be up to the Prince and Princess of Wales to take care of Harry as Charles will be too busy with coronation matters. Writing in the Telegraph she said, the royals have to look as though they are accommodating him into the royal fold, he gets enveloped into their security arrangements for the big bank holiday weekend so he can't complain that he hasn't got security. I think it will probably be beholden on the Prince and Princess of Wales to extend some sort of hand of friendship, which is going to be difficult, but it's the King's big weekend.